I won't dance. Don't ask me. I won't dance. Don't ask me. I won't dance this year with you. I'm like an ocean wave that's bumped on the shore. I feel so absolutely stumped on the floor. Especially when you do the continental But this feeling isn't purely mental For heaven rest us I'm not a space nod to Jane and Chris's comeback performance at Lily Hammer right at the end there. Now adapting to the ice did take some time for our professional perfectionist but by the looks of it he's cracked it. Suave and serenely into the rotating lift. Bringing a bit of the day job to the ice with the ballroom chassis and pivot sequence and a flyaway lift that could launch them to the top of the leaderboard. Now, believe it or not, James does get a bit nervous before big performances, but that's only because he's desperate to beat Brian McFadden. So let's get the views from the judges. Jason. Eight. Wow. <laughs> Ashley. 7.5. Jane. 7.5. Chris. 7.5. Oh, this is a big one. It's 30.5 out of 40. Week one. <laughs> Week one. So the total was, I think, there, 30.5. Unbelievable. That's yeah. extraordinary. <laughs> For once, I'm actually speechless. <laughs> Well, that's a big thing. <laughs> you, you gather yourself, shall you? We'll go and speak to the judges, because actually, I do want to find out. Jane, I mean, what an incredible start. That has to be one of the best performances we've ever seen in show one, Jane. So... <laughs> Thanks, Jane. Thank you. Jason, an eight, week one, and my... Finally, we have hope. <laughs> James <laughs> and Alexandra, that was... Absolutely beautiful. It was debonair, suave, and sophisticated, is what I Ooh. Ooh. Really, it was beautiful. It played into all of your strengths beautifully, James. And you know, what we're seeing is that there is transference from your dance background into the ice once you've mastered the skating technique. I'm not going to talk about that. What I'm loving is the performance, the partnership, and the choreography. It was sublime. Thank you. Thank you so much. Ashley? Oh, wow. I can't believe we're in week one. I cannot believe I just watched no. that. And it's funny, because sophisticated was exactly the word I was going to use. Oh, yeah, but yeah, yeah. I'm going to stick with just smooth, <laughs> buttery. I was watching it, and I, would, I just sat back in my chair, my, my pad went down, and I was like, wow. Yes, there are certain advantages that you take from your job, but translating that to the ice is a completely different story. I mean, it was so well skated. I cannot wait to see what you bring to the rest of the competition. Thank okay, you. Chris, thank you. thank you. What did you make of that, Chris? I think my fellow judges have said most of it, but I have to say, at the beginning, you could not skate for anything, could you? You were, like, <laughs> hopeless on the ice. And what you've done, you've taken it by the reins and you've mastered it. You've found the glide. Mm, and yeah. you're gliding smoothly <laughs> over the ice. You know what? It's because there's such an amazing team. You know, obviously, Alex is an amazing partner, but all the coaches as well, Jane and her team. Yeah. I had Mark Nader for, for the 30 hours. Mm. They're absolutely amazing. You know, everyone has done a great job. We've been training for three months. You've, oh, you've done the most so amazing so hard. Can well I say, done, like, I think we're going to have something extraordinary from this fellow as this series goes on. Well, we on. shall wait and see. Thank yeah. you, judges.